News on 6 starts now. Happening now, Tulsa police are looking for a prison escapee who they say kidnapped his ex-girlfriend. Good evening, I'm Craig Day. And I'm Lori Fulbright. Police say the woman is safe this evening, but that suspect, Daryl Sanders, is still on the run. News on 6's Jonathan Cooper is live near Apache and Peoria where this all started. Jonathan. Craig and Lori, Tulsa police are still searching right now for Sanders. We just received some video from a witness when all of this started earlier today. I want you to take a look at some of this video. It's from, it's from a barber named Dion Armstrong Jr. He took the video and tells me he knew something wasn't right when he saw a woman walking barefoot and crying earlier today. He told the woman to come inside his barber shop and offered her a phone to call police. That's when the woman told him her, uh, her ex, Daryl Sanders, who had just walked away Tuesday from the the Tulsa Transitional Center tried to kidnap her. Armstrong offered the woman some clothing and tried to comfort her, but before police got there, he says Sanders showed up and dragged her out of the barber shop. Armstrong tried to hold him back, but was not sure if he had a gun. This man pulls up and, and he's grabbing her. We tussle a little bit and he like, um, don't tell nobody about this. He like, look, the police are supposed to come, you know. I'm assuming he has a weapon on him. Nowadays, people got weapons on him, you know. Now to know he escaped you from prison, I mean, come on, I could have got shot. Now, police later found the woman safe near Archer in Union, but Sanders has still not been found. Now, police say he's driving a charcoal gray Grand Am with Oklahoma tag HK3253. If you see him, you are asked to call 911 immediately. We will have much more on this search coming up tonight at 6.